is the day David's cafe, bro. This is the day David's cafe, 15,000 feet. We are at 15,000 feet. 15 fucking thousand feet. And the wind speed is 7,000 motherfucking kilometers per hour. <laughs> 15,000 feet is a lot of altitude. All what we could see around us is either snow or desert with no signs of vegetation. We moved further ahead and reached 17,800 feet to sight a view of frozen lake. This part is about my journey starting from Lachin to Guru Dongbar Lake and ending at Lachon. It's 4 o'clock in the morning and we are starting for Sri Guru Dongma Lake. Uh, I think it'll take us another 6 hours to reach there. Uh, and uh, we are gonna see <laughs> snowfall over there. So it's gonna be pretty amazing. Uh, I'll see you in uh, Sri Guru Dongma Lake. Oh. It was dark and the weather was very cold. We were all freezing. quick stop over at a small food joint to have our breakfast. So we have stopped at this amazing place to have our breakfast. It's uh, very cold out here, I'm shivering like anything, I cannot even talk properly. Uh, and the entire area is just covered with snow. Uh, we, are, we are almost like two hours away from Sri Guru Dongma Lake. Um, the weather is pretty good. I can see uh, some sunlight over there. Like you can see uh, the mountains, they're covered with sunlight. Uh, so hopefully it'll be better once we reach up. We travelled on, the sun started coming up and the snow covered peaks started glowing like gold with a blue hue all around. stopped at the final check post before Sri Guru Dongma Lake. Uh, it's very cold out here. Uh, but the place is really amazing. Like you can see the views around. It's all snow. All the mountains are covered with snow. Uh, not that much of snow right now. It's a good sign. Otherwise I would have been dead by now. <laughs> After a bit of climbing, 
there was an absolute desert valley it felt as if we were going on a flat land but somewhere high in himalayas We are at 18,000 feet. The name of the location is Guru Dongma Lake, and uh, the view is amazing. Uh, so the lake is actually frozen. Uh, like you can just see, uh, there's a lake like right behind me. This is the Guru Dongma Lake, uh, and the best part is like uh, you see uh, this over here, like a frozen lake, and just when I turn around, you see like barren lands, like it's all barren lands, like. no vegetation nothing but uh, the landscape is pretty amazing we were all sleep deprived But what started as a sleepy to-do journey turned out to be the most scenic road trip of my life. There is so much to see around that you can't help but act like an overexcited 5-year-old kid at a candy shop. So we have stopped at this uh, waterfall. It is named as Amitabh Bachchan Waterfall because uh, some of the movie sequences were being shot here. So I'm going to fly a drone from here and going to have some amazing shots. So yeah. Sorry Snoopy, you can't go with us. Dogs aren't allowed on the school bus. Woof. We reach Lachung at 6 p.m. We were all very tired from the journey, and we slept early that night. With the excitement of exploring Yumthang Valley the next day. Keep checking Hopping Bird.